Hello, welcome back to Age of Water. So they finally released a big update and to be honest it's a big update and I like it. I thought they couldn't do it but they did it. So first of all let's start by trading some patch notes over here and then we'll go and play a little more but sadly I think I'll have to play a few episodes in the let's play format and then I'll have to do bigger videos for a lot of other things because I still need to do farming and questing and some other stuff. So what are the full changes? Well, we have a continuation of the Silver Fleet questline. I have no idea what that is, it's the main questline, but apparently we continue it. Antagonist questline featuring battles against 4 new bosses. We fight 4 new bosses, I have no idea how many bosses there were before, I only know of one or a few. But one was repeatable. Best to recruit 2 new crew members. Oh, that's so nice, I mean you can have 2 extra people, meaning we can have 2 extra guns on the boat. And that is great because you can have bigger ships. The shipwright has now 3 unique ships that can be obtained by completing his quests. Well, they don't say what tier the ships are, but I assume there'll be higher tier, or maybe there'll be tier 3, 4, and 5? I don't know. Crafting items and buildings no longer requires time. Finally, so you can build everything instantly, meaning you can build a building or craft, let's say, I don't know, a better material instantly. Ship module and weapon repair time has been significantly reduced. That's good. Better building returns 90% of the resources, I guess that's good. We also have the new enhanced weapons, reinforced for ranks 2 and 3, and shark, okay, so the weapons are called reinforced for rank 2 and 3, and shark for rank 4 and 5. Enhanced weapons require fragments which are obtained through fishing, treasure hunting, shark hunting, shark hunting is very important probably. You just shoot the water, in case you're wondering how you do that. Works very well with grenades. Among shipwrecks of armadas and some other ships crafted at the base. Well, I guess we can take a better look at it because I did some... I played a little bit off camera and as you can see I found 10 shark weapon remains. So I guess the, the first 2 and 3 tiers will be reinforced and I have 4 and 5 because it's the shark remains. I also wanted to show you my boat which is weirdly... I don't know, they messed up my front armor. I'm just going to leave it like that, because it looks so weird, I'll, have, I'll just leave it like that. City up tree. So, production, we have to go into production and weapons. So that's the normal machine guns, grenade launchers, uh, I have cannons tier 5 all over the place. Light battering ram. Uh, I don't see the new guns in craft. Pack 5. Powerful flak cannon, really. So I guess the new weapons will be called a little bit different, but they're more or less the same way. So we have the shark cannon. Okay, so powerful is the name of the weapons uh, that are tier 2 and 3. And shark will be the name of 4 and 5. That's actually pretty interesting. It looks so weird. Can I look at the stats? Can I just look at the stats, please? So the shotgun launcher has one. Uh, it, it's hard for me to compare. So you know what? Let's do it like this. Let's exit the base. Let's look at one of our cannons. So the damage is about 3,000. 2,000 is the lowest. 3,100 is the highest. HP is about. 2,000, uh, weight is about six or 7,000, uh, 9 energy consumption, 50 splash damage, and 70 energy per shot. Do you remember all of that? Because I'll not be able to remember all of that. Okay, so let's go over here again. Weapons. Yes. I guess it will be... What is that? Sharpened person. I have also modified the way some of these things look. Where is the shark stuff? Okay, over here. Shark cannon. Shark. Looks so silly, I cannot believe it. Okay. So, the basic stats will be more. Okay, so I guess the basic stats are much higher, but the... In Okay, so it has better AOE. Yeah, it went from 50 to 62 with same energy consumption. I guess the other stats I don't really know. Tonnage is definitely much heavier. HP is bigger. 
and may average damage will be 20 uh, well, to be honest i think it's about a 20 20 percent increase in stats if you ask me from what i can see over here so the new weapons will be about 20 percent better for the powerful or for the shark stuff which is very good because some of these weapons really needed a boost i suspect the grenade launchers will be massively overpowered now if people play with them but good luck finding people to play with them okay let's leave this thing so you can you can just look at other Boats that arrive over here in the port. Let's read more patch notes. Anchor is laid. Anchor is dropped. New armadas for playing at maximum difficulty. Lots of experience, medallions, and resources for crafting enhanced weapons. Also, new ships of ranks 3, 4, and 5 for boarding. That's amazing. Sadly, they don't give you much details or many details, but I suspect we have all of the tier 5 boats now, and then we don't longer have to play with the board dock. Increase experience gain when sinking large ships, so I guess experience was the same for if you sunk a, a little boat or a big boat, so I guess that's that really needed fixing. I guess farming will be a little easier. Repeatable PvP PV quest for lighter stage of the game, drawn from automatic loot collection built at the base. I'm convinced. Where where do you build a drone? City of three wheels is up. Uh, all of the technology I have basically whatever I needed for the base, so I guess it's in production and it will be in instruments powerful battery I have the dredge, upgraded dredge, I don't have the upgraded fishing rod I guess it will be in mechanism then Maybe we need to do a quest for the drone, Liverpool cabin. Some of this look a little... What do you mean research? How do you research it? I guess this is all new. Yeah, we'll look at all of this a bit later as well. But for now, I'm interested in finding the drone that is craftable in the base. No, no drone over here. Well, we have all of the technology research and they haven't introduced any technology. Am I missing a building or something? I don't think we're missing any building, motor, weapon. Or structure. Hmm, I guess the problem is maybe I turn off something that I shouldn't have turned off. I think I have everything turned on. It's nice to see you. Yeah, but I don't see where the drones are. Drone at the base. Drone build at the base. Maybe I'm not looking at it the right way. Maybe we should look at all. Okay, let's look at all. Yeah, I guess this will also be good to see whatever else they added into the game. Funnels, stuff like that, we already know about this. Explosives, metal shield walls, yeah, we know about that. We have enough of them. I can't believe I played 100 hours of this game. It seems kind of crazy coming back to it that I played so much of it and I still didn't really... I don't know. I don't think I even reached top 20 or something like that of the... Most farm players, not even top 50 maybe. But people are playing this game for thousand of hour, thousand hours. Yeah, I cannot see it. So the trailer showed the drone just collecting the loot that your ship passes by, so you don't have to press a button anymore. Marvelous! I want that as fast as possible. Okay, Corsair turret base. But this one. They're both in this supposed to be. There were one thousand demos in cabin. Into that base also. Now you see that everything will give you a bonus. All of the stroper structures will give you a bonus. Rats. I guess I should start building weapon parts, but I'll just wait on that decision a little more. I don't see any drones. Okay, I just assume you need to complete a few quests to do the drone stuff. Because we are 
can what? Luther drone is over here. But what where is it? I guess it's near the echo thingy. Oh rats, that's annoying. Here not. We have a solution to that. Two resources, many resources. My beautiful, beautiful medallions. I wasted so many medallions. I guess it's okay. It will be okay. Calm down. We will we'll survive this huge loss of medallions. Okay, it took a while to find, but I guess it was a bit hidden as well. So this is only a tier 3 structure. I thought it would have more tiers, but I guess it doesn't have more tiers. Sorry if I missed it the first time. I guess we'll have to also build a fishing rod. Stork fishing rod. It only goes to 4. I don't think we can have a fishing rod and a scanner, so I guess I'll do that off camera. I have a tier 5 dredge. I crafted it a couple of times, so I know I have the best one. I guess I can also make a better pump since they improved the pumps as well. Yeah, it's instant. Sit. Yeah, I need to remember how I did this, so I guess we have to go to the another way. Warehouse, okay. A lot of weird stuff around here as well. So, the looter drone does what? 100 operation radius. Uh, or just mounted. Wait, how many slots is that? I think that's 4 slots. No, it's 3 slots only. Can I put it somewhere where it doesn't look super annoying and bad? Nope. Oh, it's a tiny drone! Okay, this will be the thumbnail. That was amazing. Does it work automatically? It doesn't really specify how it does work or how we... Okay, I'll just assume it works on its own. Okay, what else did they add? New modules, including rare and theme ones. Well, we saw some of them over there, but they're obtained for enemies, from enemies. So I guess you have to fight a lot and destroy a lot of enemies. New paints available in the base store. Well, I like my evil eye look. I guess new paints will also be nice. Very black paint. So we have the moss paint. That's not new. Oh, might be new. Rockabilly paint. Nope. King Octopus was already there. Angry Octopus, I think. It's new. Camouflage. Cozy is definitely new. Simplicity is also new. Bamboo paint. Why would you want that? A rust pack. I guess you can make your ship look like it's a rust bucket. Or the strength pack, which is like what? Marble? Uh, it's rich, rich people paint. Okay. That camouflage looks interesting. Camouflage also looks interesting, but I just love my evil paint. Okay, what else? Improve balance of power supply system, change parameters of batteries, generator boost, and some skills. Improve the speed balance, can't is change parameters of some engine and holes, return capacity and synergy, blah blah blah. <sighs> to be honest, my ship, this uh, update just means they fix some of the problems people had before the update. There was an update that Basically destroy the stability of your ship, but it also improves the stability of other ships. So I guess the bigger your ship, the harder it is to maintain the stability. I'm not sure what they change overall. I am too lazy to look at one of my older videos, but it seems like I have a lot more power generation now. And power, power storage seems to be a little... I don't know, it seems like it was lower or reduced, but as you can see I have some ballast on my boat. And I'll try to put more ballast so we don't capsize every time we take a hard turn. As you can see, all of this stuff, from what I understand, it gives me hull points and does some other things like accumulators. I guess it protects your... it gives more HP to your accumulator or your generator if they are inside this structure over here, which is a little bit weird because who remembers stuff like this? So, there was a button to do something.
What's that button to show me the whole whole HP or EAB? Okay. So segment health currently is uh, 9000 maximum speed. I have no idea what changed, but they changed some stuff and it seems better right now, except uh, you'll capsize much easier at high ranks. Efficiency of high rank pumps, not important. Many decks superstructures have modifiers for the equipment to install all them. Okay, so I'll just assume whenever you see something over here, it means that it will only work for the equipment installed on them. Well, I guess they have a slot for machine guns, so they only work for machine guns. And grenade launcher, probably, and shotguns, okay. Huh, interesting. I guess they, they, all of them have interesting things to show us. Fighters, deck, oh, snappy soup. I'm not using them for that, I'm just using them as decorations and HP, HP armor almost. Armada spawn points and fishing locations are now shown on the map. I don't see them. Or maybe there's something I'm missing. Because these are my notes. And someone said that the Armandas are at 812 over here somewhere, so you have to go out of bounds a little bit. Why is there a K23 over here? I don't know. I don't see them over there. Crafting items and resources, are, okay, you can select how many you can craft. As you saw, I can craft 5 of those drone modules. Armor modules cover the hull better, okay. So, Sailor Lin will be able to wear a wig. We're all upset about her lack of, you know, good looks after you recruit her. I have no idea how you give her a wig or something like that. I have no idea of many things. And yeah, they really needed more level ups. Yeah, whatever. Fishing rods have different ranks. We discussed that. The ship rank is now visible in the ship menu. I have no idea what that is. Stability of engine sounds, fix the bartering ram damage, battering ram. The flag. Changing the flag for PvP has been reduced to 15 minutes, that's nice, so it's no longer 24 hours. Time for boarding a defeated ship has been increased 20 minutes, the previous ship now becomes a player lost cargo chest and won't be lost, okay. So if you board the ship, your cargo will be left over there in a crate and you will never be able to lose it. Well, maybe if it bugs out minefield, more minefields. With more loot, anchor ship stability, arrow to show you the extraction and direction of the whirlpool teleport. And that's it, that's a lot of changes. I like it so much. You boat. Talk to Lao Shai. Okay, let's do the boat quest if we can do it. Yeah, okay. I don't want to farm, but I guess you can do one or two quests before I end the video, especially regarding the new boats. They made that boat into an enemy over there that you see. <laughs> I guess the boat will be used by Oh no, I went into that. Our other establishment time. is always at your service, Cap. They also said they made drops for corks and they improved some other stuff. Yeah. I'll capsize a lot in this boat. I need more ballast. And we cannot do sharp doors anymore, meaning you don't no longer <laughs> drive this like it's a Mario Kart. You have to drive it like a real boat almost. City Okay, so... Laosh... Oh, it's Captain, the I've almost finished building your new boat, but bring 300 explosives and what? we'll be good to go. I'll... Alright, don't forget to make room at... 300 explosives? Are you joking me? How many do I have now? Well, I hope we find where they are. 
We do have friends. It's good to see. It's good to see you. Huh? How does that work? I don't get it. Wait for news. Well, I guess he got the explosives. Here, pits. Who's Jared? Okay, I guess you can do the reinforcements quest. There's nothing worse in the game that wait for uh, an answer. Yeah, right. Okay, the drone picked that up for me. I guess some people will love it, some people will hate it because it will pick up also the loot you don't really want. Ah, someone is doing this quest. That's a, this is the fun quest. <laughs> Out of the way. People are questing here. Yeah, I'm joking. It's nice to see that the people, that people are still playing the game. This game is not so bad, but I think they just need to make the upgrade or the big patch happen faster. This is definitely an upgrade of the game, and as you can see, they have, they have mostly changed some of the stupid ideas, like waiting for stuff to be built in your base. I don't know. I think they are leaning too much into PVE. I would have liked it if they made more PvP. Oh, wow. No, they, they changed a lot of stuff, so now I, apparently I can run out of power. Usually I can do this forever. Eh, that's sad, I guess. It's also funny to see how small the people are compared to your boat at this point of the game. Abort the Turpets, you'll always find help and support. I am commander of the Order of the Kraken. Don't trouble me over nothing. Captain, you've proven yourself a... I am commander of the Order. Abort the Turpets, your trade is... Huh? Abort the turn. Okay, so who gives you the quest for reinforcements? Abort the Wait a minute. Oh, the bartender. Abort the turpets. You're welcome to the. Oh, what a. It's pretty quiet right now. Every. Who the hell are you? Are you gonna mock me too? The same fate's waiting for all of you. He'll a job? Everyone could use a talent like mine. I'm a hot commodity, but if you give me 5,000 corks, I'm in. You can feel right at home at the Kraken Club, Captain. Abort the turpets. That's it, you. Get a new person, I guess that's it. Get Paul. Paul is a crafter, apparently, a crafter and a repair dude. But he has the gunner level, which makes cannon inflict more damage. Nice. Okay, he's level 1, rats. So I guess you have to level him up. Well, that will be impossible at this rate. But he has also the boarding master. Okay, he's really worth it then. Because of the boarding master. So who is Jared? Oh, the new... Wait. Oh no, I forgot. What is the... What is the key binding to teleport? V? Okay, sorry about this. I guess I have to look at what is the binding to teleport. Push, menu, factor, customize. Come on, what is the... Fast teleport button. Sounds locator, yeah, that was the one. Oh wow, this game is great, but they, City of they should have made this a little easier to remember. Captain, the vessel is ready. Yeah, hey, but how do you build the ship? Wait, did they actually build my... Uh, I guess it's just easier to just build another ship berth. Yeah, it's easier to just build another shipyard. Yeah, 
Okay, so what is this? Uh, it's the Liverpool. What does it have a British name? Hmm. The tier two ship that looks kind of funny. It looks like a submarine, but it has the oh, it has the uh, lower than higher deck. Okay, this would actually have been a great ship for tier two. Cast off. What else can we do? I want a higher tier ship. Captain, I've almost bring 500 explosives and we'll... All right, don't forget to make room... Huh, this is a bit annoying because I want to destroy the ship, but to do that I think I need to select this, I need to enter it. Mental it. I have the blueprints over here. Okay, so he actually builds the boat for you. Interesting. Good to know, okay. So... I guess we can head over there. So yeah, let me... see the ship stability. Man, I was having a lot of fun before the update. I guess they really needed the update. I don't know, the developers are doing a lot of good work and I can't complain about many things. But there goes the drone. But overall, I think they are doing the game a little bit backwards. They should have introduced all of the quality of life stuff before people stop playing. Like, yeah, in the beginning, people complain about. Wait, did it show me where it will go? Oh, ooh, ooh. oh no! I never happened before. This feels more like a kangaroo jumping on dry land than a boat. Yeah, the boats have a lot more inertia, especially the bigger ones. Because this boat is massive, you cannot really tell by the look, way it looks over here, but imagine that cabin is for only one person. That drone is picking up everything, I like it a lot. Yeah, I guess with this little trip also tested the drone. How much experience did I get for that? I think I got 50 experience for that. Hmm. Ah, I forgot to look at the experience. Yeah. yeah, this is so nice. I mean, it really makes the game so much more pleasant to play. And yeah, oh, seeing the pirates, 110 pirates, that's probably also a new quest, a repeatable quest. So I guess this is the main quest, so that was the ship quest, the repeatable Captain, quest. if you want to know anything about our sector, it's a tight. It's a lot. Well, I guess it will take a while to do all of these quests. Yeah, I guess I'll do the main quest later. For now, I just want to see what the new boat is. City. Captain, the vessel is. Oh, this is the limousine, it's a rank 2 ship, okay. It looks so ridiculous, why? Why would you do that the poor thing? I don't know what to say about the new boats, the tier 2 Liverpool was decent because it really looked like a boat. But this one is really a, just a... Looks like a big limousine and the cabin is just a car. Well, I guess it's a tier 3 boat, so this will be amazing. <laughs> I mean, yeah, look at this, you have a lot of space for it and it's thematical, I don't know, I guess it's supposed to be one of those fast, fast types of boats and it was supposed to do a lot of other stuff. Crazy, the game evolved really a lot, look at the size. This is a pretty big boat compared to the tier 3 Vigilante. Not bad, not bad at all. I like all of these upgrades. Wait, we have to speak to someone over here. Here as well. Sit. 
Please don't tell me you need 500 explosives. Captain, I've almost finished. Bring 700 explosives and we'll be. Crazy talk. How many do I have now? 500. So, we need 200 more explosives. Uh, I guess it can be done. Don't question it. I just have a lot of resources and that will be done instantly. It's oh. nice to see you. It's not done instantly. I guess it... Makes everything at zero speed. Which means you still have to wait a millisecond or something for every... Yeah, that's a bit annoying as well. Okay, let's go over here. Yeah, that will be done uh, pretty fast anyway. Yeah, I need more ballast. This is super slow. Captain, what knowledge? When he walks into my bar, he gets only the best on the house. I'm not proud of it. Let me tell you a story, Captain. No, he tied the poor thing to the aft and sailed into Witch's Boil. No, our establishment is all... It changed voice, like it doesn't matter. Ooh, okay, I guess we have... Uh, sure, I guess we can speak with the other people as well. So we have to go the giraffe bar. I still need to make this a little better. Yeah, good, good thing I had a lot of resources, right? What business do you oh, keep it down? It's best not. He's a shipwright himself. And what? here comes the bad part. He tied up the foreman who. Nothing. If you want to top up your wall. I, don't know, I guess it's trivia that we don't really need. Mantis bar. Oh, so we're just going to the bar state to ask about that dude. <laughs> what a strange little quest. We just ask people about that guy if they know him. Glad you came to see. Oh, you remembered. I'll tell you a story to show you what kind of a man he is. Once upon a time, he found a bar. A coarse, silly girl. She would have done better to serve him. Jared flew into a rage. The bar is in pieces all over the sector. If you don't like my stories, go listen. Fancy a drink, gorgeous. Also, oh, another quest will give you also medallions. Oh, so they still don't tell you. Hmm. I think the developers made a mistake because it's supposed to be instant crafting, but it's not really instant at all. It still takes a few minutes if you want to make something bigger. Well, I guess you have to go over there. Okay. I also want to use one of the whirlpools because they said you can choose where to land it. I mean, where to escape the whirlpool itself. Also, apparently you can... Yeah, we need to gather the shark fragments. That's going to be a very, very long, boring and grindy task. Uh, I guess I can farm the armadas, but I'll leave that for the next episode, because I think we're doing all, a lot already. They tried. Is my top speed 100? Yeah, I think my top speed is a little bigger now. I'm a bit disappointed by the fact that I can no longer go infinite. I guess even if you use up all of the energy, the energy produced is still going to be lower than the energy you're consuming currently. I guess that makes sense more or less. Looks like the trading is also better, but it doesn't really matter because as you can see my top speed right now is over 100 without the boost and with the boost is just basically a 20% boost more or less. That drone is putting all the work. In, if you're wondering why am I looking at the drone so closely, it's because I want to see if I need two drones or one drone. It, does it mean that two drones pick up more loot 
because they don't get you know, crowded. I like the new scanner as well because it shows me in the, the, the total range where I can actually get the loot. We just get 120 explosives from a single. It's so weird you can get so many explosives for it. Okay. I guess I just got lucky over there. I guess it also depends on the tier of the thing. Okay, I guess it depends on the tier of the boat, how much loot you get and on the tier of the sky. I don't know, I guess this will be a myth, but it definitely it seems like I'm getting more loot now. Hey, Captain, I've been asked to arrange a meeting. I don't remember who. Oh, city of two. <laughs> Captain, I've almost finished building your new boat. Bring 700. All right. Don't forget to make room at. Well, yeah, let's build another shipyard. So it will eat up my. That's too expensive. We cannot dismantle the basic one. Eh, I guess we'll dismantle the limousine one. I don't know. I don't want to dismantle it either. Why are you giving me so many hard decision game? Why are you doing this to me? That's done. Uh, I don't know, let's just quit the main menu, enter the game again and maybe then it will be ready. I have no idea how this works, so that's why I'm just skipping it slowly. I guess I also want to get a new crew member, but that also means I have to craft a tier 5 cannon, that is super painful to craft. But I guess I can just wait until we craft a shark cannon, so we don't waste time, but that's still a bit annoying. Also another problem is I never had enough space for another cannon. So City of trees. Captain, the vessel is ready. Vessel is ready, so then. Huh? What? 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 what is this? Oh, a Corsair. <laughs> it looks like one of those Disney World pirate ship, and it's really a pirate ship. Also comes with a. Mm, Talk wall behind it, and oh, I guess it comes with the turrets. It's kind of like an entry trailer, except it's a little better. And no, this will be the thumbnail. It's a little better. The limousine is funny, but the Corsair ship is really just a pirate ship, an old fashioned pirate ship. The stats on it are not bad. But again, it's a tier 4 ship and we're at tier 5 bobber. Okay, let's go to the bobber. Let me see if we can recruit a new guy right now. Captain, he's back. Yes? <laughs> no, 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 not in my... Oh, there you are. Hi, good to yes. see you. Have a seat. I see you expected me. He's also prepared. I feel like we got off on the wrong foot. Oh, you're gonna love it. Why does it say group over there? I have a bad feeling about this, but I guess our ship is bigger. We should be able to do it since it's a... Uh, it says group quest over there, but it's kind of like the best ship I can get in 200 hours, so... I don't know, let's just hope for the best. The special hunt. Okay. Also, just want to board the new armadas. Damn, you're pissing me off. Here I am, hero. You think you're the toughest guy in the city? I ain't, guys. I'll squash you like a bug. It's a tier five scavenger. Yeah, good luck we showed him. I don't see Jared in the wreckage. Did he get away? Looks like it gave me something. It gave me new. 
New stuff or what did he give me? We might have unlocked some new things to build. Wait, that was it? That was all? When in doubt, go to the main menu. Yeah, this is a lesson I learned a long time ago about this game. When in doubt, go to the main menu and relog. Also, they fixed the quest with the submarine, so I did the submarine quest. That was the the last quest I needed to do, so I'm happy, I'm happy about that. So basically, I finished all of the quest before the uh, before I started doing the new content. All of them. All of them. I don't know what to do next. I guess I'll just go back to the bobber. I guess the scavenger is a permanent thing. Oh, that fire hurts. Easy now, easy. As you can see, we can barely control this. What is that over there? Huh? What is this over here? I guess it's for a quest. So, can we try and shoot some of the sharks? Probably it will work, yeah, I don't have time for that. It seems to pick up everything near us, so I guess you don't need two drones. I guess then we can shoot the shark because you can clearly see them in the water. Well, that quest just says sing the pirates. I don't know, I guess we have to I don't know. I guess we'll continue the rest of the quest later. Maybe I'm missing something, but that's that's about it. See you next time. Bye bye.